What's up, everybody? I got a quick review here on the Milani egg bag. You get the instructions, or sorry, Malini egg bag, Malini egg bag to be proper and pronounce it proper and stuff. <laughs> okay, so you get the instructions. Um, you get the uh, the bag, which this material is freaking like this material is awesome. It's great. It's like a soft uh, material. You don't even you almost want to cuddle up with it at night and stuff. <laughs> it's kind of sad when you think about it. <laughs> so at any rate, it's soft. Um, now the uh, the method is, I'm sure, just the same as others, but um, the Malini is where it's at. To me, in my own opinion, the Malini is where it's at when it comes to the uh, classic egg bag effect. And this is a classical magic, which is great. And with this, you get um, the egg, which... I'm a, I'll be honest, it's a fake egg. I mean, it's made of wood, but it looks so real, it's it's unreal, you know? Well, <laughs> so, um, the ideal effect is you can, the egg vanishes from the bag, appears in the bag, transposed from, say, your your pocket, and then you reach in the bag, which, of course, obviously, you could see that. So, I drop the egg in the bag. Egg's in the bag. You reach in the side of the bag. And then you make sure that the person can feel it, which they can. And then you've got it right, right there in the center. And then you can pretend to take the egg out and vanish it from your hand, both sides. And then you turn the bag right back around. And then you take the egg right back out of the bag. So the egg can vanish from here and appear here or, you know, they can feel the egg, then it'll vanish from there. Then they'll see the feel that there's nothing in the bag. You snap your fingers, they reach in the bag, and then they can pull out the egg. The possibilities with this are really endless. Like, I drive myself nuts to try to think of a routine, but I'm, I wrote one down, but I, well, I lost it, but I'll, uh, I'll find it and do it. So let me get the uh, measurements on this bag, the uh, Malini egg bag here. And it's manufactured by Bizarre de Magi, de Magi which is uh, from Argentina, is where it's made, or Argentina. And it is freaking awesome. Like, this material and the method. I mean, look at this. I'm going to flip the bag inside out just to give you an idea of how awesome this is. Well, there you go. Flipped inside out. And I'm going to flip it back right side out. And there you go. So the length of it is, and yes, I have a ruler handy. It's my red ruler. Um, inches wise, it is approximately... Eight and a half inches approximately lengthwise. When well, I say that, it's a. Uh, yep, right at eight and a half inches is the uh, length. So that's eight and a half inches uh, up and down and horizontal. And uh, the uh, width wise of it is, I'm going to be exact here because I don't want to give you the false measurements. Also, eight and a half. Eight and a half inches by eight and a half inches is the uh, total size. So eight and a half by eight and a half. And that's according to my ruler. I know because it's my very special ruler. It's my special little ruler. My special little ruler. <laughs> eight and a half by eight and a half. The Malini egg bag. Possibilities are endless. I can't wait to see your own routines and patterns. If you got any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them below and I'll be happy to answer you as soon as possible. Um, other than that, you have a great day, and thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.